Yo, this is my new pose. Do you like it? So if you're online for, well, most of your life, like myself, then you'll start to realise that there are certain different types of people, one of which are edgy teens. Now, I have identified certain types of characteristics of said edgy teen that I'm going to talk to you about today, just in case, you know, you wanted a bit of a personality switch up and you wanted to become one, or you just wanted to laugh at the types of people that we have in society today. You know, either one works. All right, so let's start off with music. Now, music is an incredibly important part of being an edgy teen, and the music taste of said edgy teen is always better than everybody else's, period. It's not like music is a subjective thing that requires opinions and tastes in order to like something that somebody else might not like. What? Oh, uh, no, um, it's not mine, I was just holding it for a friend. If it's not Catfish and the Bottle Men, the 1975, or Arctic Monkeys, then you can get fucked. Pop music is a synthesized abomination created by the government to keep us all in line that only brainwashed normies would listen to. Speaking of music, they will listen to 21 Pilots, but only their old stuff, and they will express an outward hatred to the entire Blurry Face album, because that's when they started becoming mainstream, and popularity is bad for some reason, don't really know why. Now fashion is very important for an edgy teen. You know, they usually wear black to represent their soul and you know, just express their hostility towards the external world or something. That and most of them are still in their 2009 emo phase. Yeah, unexpected G notes on a piano still fuck them up. An edgy teen will always have a general air of superiority to them and will always have a strong hatred of capitalism, men, happiness, straight people, people people, anything mainstream, Minions, you name it, they hate it. Anyone want some marijuana? Now, a key part of an edgy teen lifestyle is making edgy memes about suicide and depression online and, you know, claiming that you're valid in doing so because you were sad that one time. And when anyone else makes the same joke, the inner social justice warrior inside of you comes out to play because that's offensive. You can't make jokes about that. I'm offended. Side note, offensive is a key word in the vocabulary of an edgy teen, so you might want to get used to that. Now, because an edgy teen is too edgy to have real life friends, they will always make a habit of arguing online with strangers, and then when they proceed to run out of arguments or get offended, they will result in using their best friend, the block button. Jeremy Corbyn is a god, and anyone that doesn't think so is a dirty Tory and deserves to roast in Satan's fiery asshole. I mean, I don't actually know anything about politics, but he seems like a pretty cool guy and you know all my friends are voting Labour so and finally in order to be a true edgy teen you must make angsty videos in your bedroom about your troubles concealed by a thin veil of light-hearted comedy so that people don't know that you're actually really sad and then upload them to YouTube for no one to watch just kidding I'm not an edgy teen I'm just sad well, what a shit show that was honestly I have absolutely no idea what that was I just wanted to take the piss out of some people online so there you go, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did enjoy it, you can let me know by leaving a thumbs up. Did I really just do that? I want to die. No, but seriously, if you did enjoy it, please go down there and leave a cheeky thumbs up. It really does mean a lot to me and it really helps me out. And if you want to leave a comment, go and comment something in the description. I mean, well, not in the description, in the comments. What? I'm, I've only done this for two years. Why do I not know what I'm saying? And if you want to see more videos from me in the future, you can click my face up here to subscribe to my channel. I make videos like this every single week. So subscribe and turn on my notifications. See you guys next week with another video. Bye.